So what we've got here is some rubber conductive buttons from an old tire balancer that really weren't working very well. The contacts that they go on, you can see that they're kind of worn and they were a little dirty from the rubber buttons. Even after cleaning those contacts, they just didn't quite work well. So here's a little preview of how hard it was to get them to work. Um, and then I'll show you what I did to fix them. Gotta press kind of hard to get these buttons to work. Here's one of the buttons just as a test. Seems to work very well. And we just got to do the rest of them. Luckily, my application wasn't that critical. Uh, as you can see, I've got different sizes on here, but they all seem to work pretty good for what I'm doing. And there's no way I was ever going to find a button pad like this. I can't even find a user's manual for this machine. All right, we got everything back together with the parts from P1 Repair. Let's see how it works. Barely any pressure, everything seems to work. These three buttons get used the most on this machine. And they're now working amazing. Hopefully will for a long time. As you can see, this was a perfect use case for the parts from P1 Repair. I don't know how else I would fix these conductive buttons and uh, it brought this old tire balancer back to life. Um, I would definitely use this product again. So if you have any key fobs, remote controls, anything with conductive rubber buttons, keep them in mind. Um, I'll put some links down below for what I ordered from Amazon and a link to their main website as well. Thanks for watching.